First of all, it's a very interesting uh, picture of elections in Sicily. It's grotesque, it's funny, um, it's an enjoyable documentary. And then I think the most important thing is that 4,000 people have voted for it. So this documentary has won the first Italian um, online documentary festival. And it's been an experiment that has worked and has allowed us to connect a bigger audience with very valuable uh, documentaries. So I hope this is going to continue in future years and that your, I mean, the audience will grow and will be counting on you in, uh, in the future. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, do you want to... And, uh, can I also ask you all to give us a very great applause because we have here the documentary director in person, Giuseppe Schillacci. And... <laughs> and I don't know if Giuseppe wishes to say a few words, maybe. No, I just, I'm going to be there at the end for the Q&A, so just enjoy the, the film. It's a... Uh, Maybe something to say, it's a French production. Again, the film was shot in Palermo, in my own city. And uh, even if uh, at the beginning it was a kind of auto production, but then it became uh, a French production because in Italy at the moment it's very difficult to produce documentary and cinema in general, but we are not here to complain. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And, uh, so I enjoyed the. Uh, and, uh, Enjoy. Enjoy. And also, I'd like to introduce Luisa Pretolani, a documentarist and a producer, who will be doing the QA with Giuseppe. So, all of you? Sorry. Oh, yes, also, of course, Luisa not only is to do the QA with Giuseppe, but also she was one of the three jurors who voted the documentaries. The other two are not here tonight, Tony Carr and this, this Cathy McCann from the BFI, but they're not here tonight. So uh, enjoy the documentary and we'll see you at the end for the Q&A. And um, because it was a very good experience, also for my point of view, the auto, because um, you see that uh, your film can reach lots of people even if they are not in a, in a cinema hall. That is a very good thing, even if uh, everybody knows that uh, seeing films in the cinema hall is always better, <laughs> of course. But um, it, uh, it gives the, the, the possibility to, to, to see the film also to, to people that are not, or they, they don't, they don't, don't have the habit to, to go to festivals, for example, or to watch television, or <coughs> even because the, 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 the distribution in the, in the cinema, in classical cinema, circuit cinema distribution, it's very difficult for documentaries, so seeing it online could be a possibility, is a possibility to, to, to reach an audience and to have a feedback with, with, with them, because Always there is, uh, with social networks, the work that uh, Francesca um, uh, made it very well, with the social network you have always the, um, the possibility to, to have a feedback from the, the site of the, of the film, uh, uh, from the part of the, of the audience, or the single person that watched the film uh, in this house. So, it's a good possibility. I, I've done uh, my, my with my first film. I've done a festival online in, in France. It was called uh, Festival Pondoc, and it was the first edition. It was uh, three years ago, and uh, and I won uh, and I won that festival so online. Or maybe it's, it's a good thing. Yes, <laughs> festival online because uh, uh, it's it's, um, it's a way to, to to share the documentary because it's. It's not easy to, to, for the documentary makers to to be seen to to, to show their their films in, a, in normal cinemas or even in normal standard festivals. So it's a good it's a good thing. Thank you. Uh, 
And now we go more into the nitty-gritty of the documentary making, this documentary. Uh, why deciding to, to choose a subject like the local election in Palermo in 2012? What was the reason to choose that? But if I have to be sincere, I was, um, in my, I was living in Rome and I was in my room looking at uh, YouTube. I'm from Palermo, I lived there. We up there uh, since I was 20 years old. I was living there, so I, I watched this candidate, uh, Papa Lado, the musician, artist, carabiniere. You know. <laughs> Forgive me. <laughs> I saw him. Uh, I was watching it on YouTube, uh, make, making, um, doing a meeting, and it was uh, incredible. This is, if, if this is true. Uh, this is real. Yes, uh, yes. A, this could be. It's, a, it's a, like a, a point of, a, of an iceberg. You know, maybe there's something more because uh, we are living in a period, in, in a time in which everything is confused. The sense of politics is is fucked up. Uh, <laughs> so maybe it's not very maybe we should polite. Maybe should blur. Blip <laughs> <Maybe> and blur. It's <laughs> post yeah. so it's fine. <laughs> Thank you. Sir. Uh, and so. Um, if he's there, it's because every, everyone could improvise politician now. Because we have lose the sense of politics, we have lose the sense of community also, and the sense of being part. I'm talking for, from Palermo, from Sicily, from Italy in general, because it's, uh, it's not something special of Palermo. It's in Italy in the last 20 years at least. We are living in a situation where everything could be politics, and the show, the show is politics, mm -hmm. and uh, every, every, everything is linked to the, this, uh, this uh, appealing, uh, to this uh, divertissement, mm -hmm. yeah. and um, and so we we lose this sense, and we 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 do politics now with this kind of. Um, of a pittoresque or grotesque uh, attitude that is not only Italian, or, or it was not only Italian in origin, because uh, I remember that, um, I remember you also, that the first actor, uh, Hollywood actor, that was, uh, that was in politics was Ronald Reagan, that was not Italian. He was not also British, he was American, yeah. so... Yeah, uh, yeah. But there is uh, something Schwarzenegger there. was the governor of California. Uh, we, we, everybody remembers Schwarzenegger. Yeah. And, now we, and now we have Pepe Grillo who is trying his we, best. We, it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, we, uh, yes, so it's, uh, it's a kind of, of a spectacularization, a you know, show, the politics is it's only a show. I don't, I don't want to say that the show is a bad thing uh, for definition, by definition, but if it it is, it is only a show, so the ideas, the sense of community, the sense of the good and evil is uh, losing, is, uh, is apart. Uh, then we are confused, we don't know what to think about our future, mm -hmm. and, uh, and that's, that's what I find when, uh, what I found when I I came to, to Palermo, to my hometown, to shoot this uh, electoral campaign because I, uh, I see that every character, both sides, left and wing, left and right, or uh, all these um, civil movements that were provided, they had no sense of politics or, or a new sense that they they supposed to have, but that. Uh, it's very difficult to understand because you don't have the roots, uh, or, or anyway, you, don't, you, you are talking about the internet as a, something very new, but internet is a, is a for example, it's a media, it's a, it's a media, it's, it's not a, 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 a meaning, you know, a continent, uh, a, and so um, it's only a form, it's only a, a way to, to yeah. talk to people. Giuseppe, I'm going to, just going to stop here because I know we have quite a limited time and uh, it is a documentary that uh, I'm sure we have people in the public who would like to ask some questions directly to Giuseppe. Uh, yes, please. Any credits I read the name of Franco Marisco? What was his role in the making of... 
I, I, met it, I met him at the beginning of the film. Sorry, uh, the no. question was what is the role of Franco Maresco who appears on the thank you credit? Uh, Franco Maresco is a big, uh, yes. very important, very good uh, director, cinema, cinema director from Palermo. I, I knew him from before and I met him the, the first days of this, um, this director competition I was to shoot. And uh, he was shooting also something about uh, Napolitan uh, singers in Palermo. So we met during this electoral campaign. We shared a lot, and I shared a lot in, the, in, this, in, the, in what were my uh, my mission, what I what I would have to, what I would like to to tell with this film, and he helped me a lot in understanding. Uh, and also, it's it's a kind of. Um, Kind of uh, 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 acknowledgement of uh, what he has done. He and Daniel Cipri presented my film in Rome uh, last year. What, what they, they have done for the for the Italian cinema, this grotesque. Okay, so I just repeat the question in case people on the back. Uh, um, uh, what's your name now? Pasquale. Pasquale was uh, finding a bridge between some influence from Maresco's film, a uh, documentary shot in Palermo, and uh, Giuseppe's film on the way that the people of the crowd, which is in fact uh, one of the main interpreters, one of the main actors in your film. So is there influence there from Maresco? Yeah, um, as, a, as a filmmaker, as a director, uh, coming from Palermo, I like a lot of his cinema. It's, it's kind of been uh, very uh, related to this reality. It's a, like a, it's a bit surreal, absurd, and uh, and to tell it without uh, what I, what I, I try to do is uh, to have a, anyway in a, in a way a distance. So I, uh, I was trying to not to be uh, not to ridiculize my characters, but to, to show them as they they want to be shown. Mm -hmm. So this this I think the, the I think also Maresco does in his uh, cinema. Mm -hmm.